Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying some Snack Factory Pretzel Crisps Bites. I have the honey mustard. Uh, spicy ranch and garlic and herb. These were $7.49 at Kroger, and that is for a 12-ounce bag. And so, someone had asked me if we had tried, they sent me a picture of the garlic and herb and wanted to know had we tried it. And, uh, I, you know, I saw these months ago in Kroger, and I didn't pick them up because there's so many Snack Factory pretzels, it's hard for me to keep track. But I specifically looked for that one, and I didn't see it uh, where we had reviewed it, so I thought, well, I'll get all three of these. They also had a sea salt. I didn't get the sea salt. It's going to be a pretzel. It's... Basically. Yeah. With the same texture. It's a, Yeah, it's a pretzel. Uh, uh, but... So, if we have tried these, then we're just going to try them again. We haven't had them in a while if we have had them. But now, if you do a search, uh, Tammy Dunn Snack Factory, we did one video with like, it was like a three-part, it was years ago when like I had first started doing reviews. But we, um, we did all kinds of things. And so, there's a lot of flavors to choose from. But these are the uh, Honey Mustard. And uh, it says light, crunchy, and munchable. Baked, not fried. Colors sourced from plants. No high fructose corn syrup. 12 servings per container. One ounce, 28 grams. About 14 pretzels are 130 calories. Not bad. And these are distributed by Snyder's Lance in Charlotte, North Carolina. So they're showing you on the back. You have the original size. And then you have the little mini one next to it. That's what these bites are going to be, is that little one. So I buy, a lot of times, uh, when I buy a bag of uh, Snack Factory, I like the uh, garlic parmesan. It's in a green and white bag. And I will take that and dip it in the, um, I, buy, I like the spicy pepper jack laughing cow cheese. And I like to dip it in there. This would be a good size to do that too. Those are small. That's kind of a, a sweet. sweeter mustard. Mm -hmm. It's sweet. Definitely sweet. They also seem a little thicker than the, than the last time I tried these. She's had them more recently than I have. Mm -hmm. It seems like the other ones are just really, really thin. Mm -hmm. These seem thicker. Well, I don't know. I like them though. They are sweet though. They're not as mustardy as I would like. The, uh, they're not like the, um, isn't it Snyder's of Hanover? Mm -hmm. um, yeah, this is Snyder's Lance, but. But the, the honey mustard ones? Oh yeah, I love their honey mustard. Yeah, these are not like those. No, so if no, you, completely different flavor. If you buy those, and those are the little pieces, those are like, packed with, uh, they have a powder on them. Mm -hmm. They have loads and loads of flavor. It's a really, really strong flavor. Mm -hmm. It's mustard, but it's also just a touch sweet. These are kind of... This is, is sweet from the get-go. It's sweet from start to finish. And you do get a hint of the mustard, but it's, it's mainly... It's literally a hint. It's a hint. It's mainly just sweet, because yeah. I love mustard. It is just mainly a sweet mm -hmm. pretzel. Um, I do think these are a little puffed up more. Yeah, yeah. Um, so when you're biting them, they feel a little thicker because mm -hmm. the, when you normally get the the bigger ones, it's they're almost flat. like it's almost like they're just the top part of the pretzel, like yes. the, the tough skin. Yeah, that's it. You know, it's yes. they're so thin. These have a puffiness to yeah. them, so it it uh, as far as the texture of it, it's there's it's a smaller pretzel but it feels like there's more of that pretzel dough to mm -hmm. chew on in your mouth. Yeah, um, I agree. Well, even in the comparison here, you can see they're puffier on that one. This one's kind of flat and not quite as puffy. Right. Up. This is a spicy ranch. Or if anything spicy as a hot Uh, 14 pretzels are 130 calories. It says uh, garlic powder, spices. The spice includes mustard and red pepper. So it might be a little hot. They're definitely crunchy. Mm -hmm. um, they got a little zing to them. Mm -hmm. They're also a little 
I hate to say hard, but they're harder than um, the bigger ones because um, they're thicker. I do get the ranch, definitely oh, get yeah. the ranch. You know it's ranch, and I like that. It tastes like a you were dipping that into a Hidden Valley Ranch mm -hmm. uh, dip. And it's um, got just a little bit of a tingle on your tongue from the peppers. Very, very, very little no. though. Um, it's very little. Like it doesn't bother me at all. No, no, it's not that hot. It's where it's like, ooh, that's hot. Mm -hmm. It's something like that. It's just like a little tingle, just to let you know there's some peppers. Yes, there. and I like these, and I could eat them by themselves. Mm -hmm. But then again, too, I think it would these would be really nice actually dipped in more ranch. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. like they gave you ranch and then dip it in more ranch. Just be, well, for me, it's like I'm used to eating those garlic Parmesan, right. like I said, with that cheese. And I really like the texture difference of that soft cheese and that really crunchy pretzel. And it's not cool. Because I don't eat pretzels. We right. don't, we, neither one of us do that. We, we, don't, we don't buy pretzels as a snack. And, and tons of people do, they're popular. But for me, it, I don't want to eat them really unless I'm dipping them in something. Right. I like these though. Unless they're really, really, really strong. So we have had some that had a ton of powder on them. Yeah. These aren't like that. I would still want to dip these. I mean, you don't have to. You don't have to, but I would want the to. The honey must be you need something else really, but not the ranch. You don't need anything with the ranch. I would just want to. That's right. just me personally. Can you do that without me having to cut it? I don't think you cut it. I don't think I got it at all. I know. So we're going to have to cut it. Oh, I heard it. I heard the air. I heard the air seeping out of the top. It's a little thin line. Ooh. Ooh. What are these garlic? Garlic and herb. They smell, though. You know, like we've had pizza snacks. Oh yeah, they, they, they smell like rosemary. They smell, Which is, if you've watched our channel, you know that's one of my favorite seasonings. I love it. Rosemary. <laughs> oh yeah, rosemary and garlic. Mm. That. What that, escape. It had to leave. <laughs> um, that uh, does remind you of a focaccia bread. That's too strong for me. Mm. I love focaccia bread. If you like rosemary, then you'll like those. Mm hmm. And they I, don't need anything with them. I don't like them. Unless you wanted to get the original laughing cow and you could dip it in there. But just it does. That just to add some creaminess to it, but it doesn't need it at all. Those, I love those. Those are 14 or 130 calories. Those are my favorite ones here. Mm. No. Yeah, they have a ton of flavor. You do need to like rosemary. Oh yeah, because um, they're strong. It's it, more rosemary than garlic even. Yes, the rosemary is the strongest flavor in here and then the garlic is secondary. Mm -hmm. You um, get the garlic, but it's not as strong. Mm -hmm. I think they're incredible, uh, but I like rosemary and I like rosemary. We've had rosemary potato chips mm -hmm. and I, I just, I really like that. Yeah, there's a very specific, that's a, it's a very specific spice and it stands out no matter what. And I like, you I just would get, don't like it. I just don't like it. Yeah. Um, I would get the ranch ones. Um, the, the honey mustard I wouldn't buy because they don't have any mustard flavor. I, the honey mustard are just sweet. So, I mean, really, they truly, unless we just got a, a, a some dud duds off the top. Yeah, I can't imagine. Um, because we were randomly picking them, and so I, I think that's just the way they are. They're just all very light, sweet pretzel. Mm -hmm. uh, these, I'm always going to pick, uh, This I'm going to be buying my favorite over and over again, so I would just buy these uh, garlic and herb and not buy any other ones. But if I had to pick a second one out of these three, it would be the spicy yeah, ranch. They're good. Ones. But yes, these would make a great snack. Like we said, you can dip them. You don't have to, of course. I'm always extra. Um, but you could definitely, especially the rosemary ones, if you like rosemary, they're strong enough to where you're going to enjoy them all by themselves. They don't need one thing. Yeah, I think the ranch is the same way. I don't think they need anything. They don't. They, they don't at all. Yeah, they're fine um, the way they are. <laughs> they're fine. Yeah, they're fine just the way they are. And you wouldn't have to, you know, I specifically mentioned that laughing cow cheese just because it's soft. But you could get a, a tub of of dip or anything. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to think of what things people pair these with. 
I'd say uh, this would be just a snack on its own. But. I think too. I think especially these, you would want them by themselves. Yeah. So I will have a picture for you at the end, and thanks for watching.